Yo. Yo. Question time. Yeah. What's cops up, sir? Time. Kelso? Kelso, honestly. Kelso, do you understand that we are cops? Honestly, Kelso, really nice tie, but did you Kind of nice tie. Dude, that's a pretty nice tie. Yo, the 60s called in advance, and they said, give us back our tie. They're like, sick tie, you time traveler. Come back yeah. here. All here right. Here we go. Army sir plus morphine. Kelso. You okay, Phelps? It's doing this thing again where I can't press X. Keep tapping the controller. I think it's just while he's talking, I can't do it. Now do it. Do you know that there's a gang war going on in L.A. trying to recover that stolen morphine? That has nothing to do with me. Okay, but okay. aside from the fact that he uh, completely evaded the question. That dude, hold on. Chris, punch <laughs> into that guy's face. That dude looks like he just fucking drank a <laughs> bottle of Aquafina and it's sweating out in his pores. Yeah. I doubt. Th oh my god! <sighs> I don't know anything about it. Yeah, Dowdy boy. Dowdy boy. Dowdy boy. Dowdy boy. I'm sure it would be gripping to hear more of your life story, boys. But the truth is, I don't give a fuck. God Whoa, damn it, Roy! Roy. Oh, Calm the fuck down, you racist you schmuck. You really think a bunch of Marines could muscle in on the dope racket <laughs> in this town? <laughs> in the vice squad and the mob, I hear it's pretty sewn up. You better watch your mouth. Okay, ex Marine McGoldrick. Was that a yet? Did we like win that? I think we did. All right. <laughs> did you know that Eddie McGoldrick recently came into money and bought a nightclub? No, I didn't know that. All right, he's still sweating. Whoa. Did his mouth just like fade to another mouth? <laughs> like crossfade? It crossfaded. Uh, I mean, he's not lying. <sighs> Look at that. Yeah, he's pretty locked on now. That's lake. That's a that's a that's a that's a peaceful lake of a face. All right, I I say dowdy, but if you're gonna tell the truth, if you say truth, I'll go with you I'm on it. I'm going truth. Look all at that. All right, all right. I just don't trust the man. Lobsters blew his brains out last night. No, I didn't. Damn, I believe him. Arm stolen from Cool Ridge. Oh, he's, he's sweating. Okay, he's sweating. Tell us about the arms. You heard that a crate of VARs went missing. No, I didn't. Uh, he's telling the truth again. I think so. I mean, right? Yeah. I look at him. He's, he's making the moving. exact same face as last time. He's telling the truth. I saw Felix Alvaro today. Good. How was he? A little pale. One of Mickey Cohen's goons had emptied about sixty VAR rounds into the bus he was driving. A public. In the middle of Hollywood. Are you going to tell me what's going on? Or do more innocent people have to die? Yeah, and what's in it for you, Cole? I'm Newspapers? I'm a cop. Glory, I'm a cop. Another promotion? I it's solve our crimes. Cop. We are cops. Country, count me out. I solve crimes. That's what I do. You can't stop me. You can't stop me. I solve crimes. All right. Uh, hey, dude. I'm going to ask you about the Cool Ridge robbery. What do you think? What do you know about the Army surplus robbery from the Cool Ridge, Jack? What I know is that on three separate occasions, you would have been dead if it weren't for me. Are you fucking kidding me? about the robbery. <sighs> Whoop. He's... He's... He's his nostrils. Definitely... His nostrils are, like, continually widening. Oof. Oh, well, we don't have anything to say he's lying, so but we have to Do doubt we? him. We have no we have no evidence to throw him at it. It's what? just we know that he's lying. What about the manifest? His name is on the manifest, but I guess that I don't know. I guess not everybody on the boat knows everything anything about the Yeah, I <sighs> damn. I don't know. He I think we should just doubt him and call it safe. Yeah. All right, fuck it. Fuck it, beer bros. People are dying because morphine intended to help servicemen is being used on the street. Now we have guys from our old unit being killed by mobsters. Being we killed by monsters. Together, Jack. Damn. Gratitude isn't a concept that has much effect on you, is it, Cole? Answer I the question, Jack. Let's Dude, I'm a fucking cop, bro. I was interviewed when the robbery took place. <laughs> I don't have anything further to add. What a shitlord. Well, we got all the questions right. Bullshit, Cole. Did you seriously believe that dragging me down here would get me to give up my own guys? You call yourself a Marine? Trying to make a name for yourself with this shit heel? Look at this chump. With his $200 suit and $2,000 car. Whoa. The tough guy act is really impressive. 
I like you, Jack. I'd like to make you for this. I really would. I'm going to be working on it and keeping an eye on you. You can go now. Greetings, Robert Steiner, 6780 West Sunset Boulevard. The victim is the Chris Majowski. Another name from the manifest? What? These criminals have absolutely perfect timing. These criminals are killing it. That dude came right in as that interview was over. Robert Steiner? Yeah. Man, that Hollywood police station, I'm worried that we'd be, like, we're going to get there eventually and they're going to be like, oh, uh, this police station closed two years ago. I think that's where we're at. Aren't we at? Dr. No, that's our, that's our police station, isn't it? Uh, I don't think so. Maybe it is. Or hate each other. We go back a long way. You went too easy on him. Next time, you leave it to me. I know how to handle that smug son of a bitch. You don't. Jack will never give up his own men. That's so shady, dude. Any of the vicinity officer needs assistance. 1825 North Highland Avenue, 1825 North Highland Avenue. Don't cross the street. Don't cross the street. Great. No accidents, baby. You see that? Yeah, I see it. Perfect. For now. Perfect. They just walked up and shot the man. How are they so close? They went that way. Go, go. Go, Alex, go. Go, Alex, go, Alex, go. Guys. Guys, that was a funny joke. That was not Hello. a joke. You ran into a divider. That was such a funny joke, guys. Go off the ramp. Now's your chance. Damn! What if it blew, like, all my tires off? <laughs> Alright. Oh. Left, left, left. I'm gonna try and head him off. Is really? That, yeah. Does that not work? It's no good. We need to get closer. I'll try for the tires. Keep your foot down. What? car can turn like that what car can turn like this you keep running into people no fuck everything about this driving mechanic fuck it it's not me you guys this car is not like the things that it wants you to do there's no way you I guys could... can't tell but kelly is watching in silence and man what wait what Go it went inside the building. See, this this is the kind they don't tell now you, you when to go inside. Yeah, they don't tell you when it's the kind when they're supposed to outrun you and get to a shootout, or when it's the kind when you actually have a chance to catch them. That dude. Okay, he's down. The guy on the right. There you go. Headshot. All right. See, you know what I can fucking do? Shoot people. I'm fucking good at it. All right. <laughs> Perfect cop. Look at me. Solving crimes. Alright, let's start investigating. Is that a BAR? It is another BAR. Another stolen BAR. He's not even gonna remark on it now? You literally talk when I pick up shit that you somehow psychically know has nothing to do with the case? Turn him over. That is a face. You know who he looks like? Uh, he looks like uh, the dude from the monkeys. What's that guy's name? Patrick. Look, this guy looks enough like the dude from the monkeys that, like, you will know the guy that I'm talking about. Patrick, Chris, Ted, whoever's editing this. I want to see that guy's face on the screen right now. Look at look at how much they look the same. F fuck. All right. All right. What do we got? I have no idea. I'm just I'm following your lead. I'm just looking at this body. I'm looking at this man's body. Uh, I'm going to call shenanigans because you, you shot this guy in the head. No, this was the guy that I shot like nine times in the belly. That's every person in this game. No, dude. I get headshots when I want to. <laughs> Mickey's meeting, 9 p.m. at Newsview building, Sheldon. Sheldon? Mid-20s, 5'10", dark hair. Does this guy hate the Big Bang Theory? This guy's gonna go Check rub the other out pocket. Sheldon. Dude, I love the the weave on this suit. All right, it's the same manifest. An LA 
NYPD file. Grauman's Chinese. All of the names on the list have a hit team assigned to Higgins and Connolly. Grauman's Jeez. Chinese. Okay, so I'm gonna go. Well, I gotta go look at the other guy too, I guess, huh? Yeah. Shit. So much evidence just on that one. Oh, newspaper. <gasps> Plot? LAPD vice scandal could go all the way to the top. Yeah, this is a big boy. Should we go in? Yeah. Dude, that's uh, Sally Draper's grandfather. The police chief. From Mad Men. We can't allow that strumpet Brent Allen to bring down the whole administration. We've got to put a lid on the press. can someone talk to Harry over at the Times? It's too late. The Times would look ridiculous if we dropped the story now. Who is this Stoker? Stoker's a lily white. Nothing that will fix this in the short term. My law and order credentials are disappearing as we speak. Can we get Brenda to leave town? Yes, we can, but she won't go quietly. Brenda has extensive records. Can she at least lay low? That's already been taken care of. What the f... Mayor? Whoa. God damn it. District. Who is this guy? And what does he want, Horrell? Name's Roy Earl, detective, administrative vice. Aren't you one of the clowns that got us into this mess? Oh, I think that the orders regarding Brenda come down, not up, Mayor. I have a human interest story. It involves a certain LAPD cop. Oh, no. Oh, my God. Who has let his beautiful wife and kids down. Who has betrayed America for a German junkie whore? Who has abandoned his pledge to the LAPD and his commitment to the public? Dude. We all serve. It'd be all over the papers by tomorrow, and you would be off the hook. Holy shit! He's making so the power play. What do you want in return, Roy? Fingering a fellow officer. Guys, you gotta what watch. What do we say from the fucking beginning? Guys, you gotta what go watch. What do we say from the beginning? If you guys if you guys are loving this story and you haven't watched LA Confidential yet, you just need to go do it. Alex, that. turn around and shoot that man. He's right behind you. Shoot him. Shoot him! Do it. <laughs> do it. <laughs> Come here. Come here. Come here, you schmuck. Come here. Come here. Come here, you so I guess we can't examine the second body. Come here. It won't let you. You keep walking through it. He doesn't even have physics on half of his body. That, that did you full on shot in the head. Yeah, this guy got shot so hard he lost all the physics in the lower half of his body. <laughs> Alright, well, fuck. Guess I'll just keep solving crimes like I don't yeah. know that that happened. So should we go to the post office or the Chinese theater first? That's a great question. Uh... Maybe just the post office because the Chinese theater is more likely of a place to be a shootout at the end of this case. All right. All right. Let's do it. Come on, you traitor. You dirty, dirty, Get dirty Get in the traitor. car, traitor boy. The thing that sucks is that I'm playing as Cole and we both, Why? like me and Roy, both found out at the same time. I met a traitor boy. I said to him later, boy, I'm going to shoot you in the head. I'm going to shoot you in your suit. <laughs> Alex, I'm very surprised you've not been on your suit game the past few episodes. This is a great suit. <laughs> what do you mean? You just you haven't been... I think I'm like settling into this suit. I think it truly might you be... You found the suit? Your I, suit? I mean, look, if they have another one shows up, you better believe I'm going to put it on. I'm just saying, there's a lot... You haven't you haven't felt the need. You almost hit that, that, that void. I bet I didn't void it. You almost voided it. But I didn't. Wow, I was totally wrong about the shootout. Holy shit. I was completely wrong about the shootout. Look at this. This is the biggest post office that I've ever fucking seen. Oh my god, what are you guys doing in there? Why would you try and take over a government building, you fool? There's too many cops are dying, man. Dude, every time anything happens, I'm watching these cops die, and then I kill all the criminals. Who's doing this? Yo, back of the gun. Oh my god, Alex, stop. What? Look oh my god. at that man. He's not... I see him. He defies gravity. He's like, uh, Chris, punch in and play a clip from De from Wicked. Alphaba. Alphaba. Defying gravity right there. Just really subtly. Dude, he's like in the Matrix. 
Defying gravity. Are they like moving into the building? Do I need to follow them? I don't think so, right? There's a guy right there. Come on, pop out. Got him. Nice headshot. What was that? I said nice headshot. Oh, that's right. Speaking of headshots, Alex and I went on an audition the other day and we didn't have our headshot. Very yeah. un unprofessional for actors. Um, Chris, put a picture of my headshot on the screen. Uh, as you can see, I photoshopped the Eiffel Tower into the background of my headshot. Is that really what you did? Because Dude. I thought it would be hilarious a couple years ago when I needed a headshot, if I had the Eiffel Tower in the background. <laughs> also, my headshot is classy in black and white. Huh. Alright, time to search some more bodies, it looks like. Oh. 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 Oh, he's still alive! Tell Courtney... Bad, bad luck. <coughs> it was worth a try. It was worth a try. <laughs> oh. That was so creepy. God. That was so creepy. Beckett. Beckett's confession. He was like, I work with Courtney, basically. Lenny Finkelstein, general manager. Really did it. Wonder whether it was worth it. Wow. Most people never get the chance to be rich. Wouldn't you risk it? Wow. Whoa, dude. Crazy. Okay, so. He I can't go in his pockets. I guess I can't. God, that was spooky. Let's let's oh, check wow, out the other body. That, they already cleaned that dude up real fast. Well, there's there was five to two shots, so they were all back here, but they're like not there. Well, there's blood right there. All right. Oh, oh, there you go. This guy also gonna be alive. Okay. Um, Check pockets. Okay. Nothing in there. Another pocket. Okay. We Here what we go. We what is this? What do we got? Meeting with Cohen and Sheldon, 1640 North Las Palmas. Later, later tonight. tonight. 1640 North Las Palmas. Jeez. They gotta stop carrying shit like that around on them. Got anything on your wrist, brother? Still not getting that Zelda chime. We're not so perfect anymore, man. We can't always win. Uh, yeah, we can. <laughs> there it is. All right. To the Chinese theater, let's go. Get in the car. Screw Roy. Just leave without him. Why are we waiting for him? Just literally get in the car and don't wait for him. I'm gonna do it. I'm doing you it. You should just leave him. Where do I need to go? The meeting place or the Grommans? Chamans. Chamans? Grommans. Chamans. Grommans. Chamans Grinies Theater. Aw, oh, goddammit. We took too long. I thought it would, like, pause good. the game, kind of. I feel like the fat kid at the back of a race. Come on, Roy! The it's just they done fat dudes way. now, too? Your buddies are in way over their heads. We gotta go back to Chamans Grinies. Oh, man. Dude, I, you know, I usually like to have Chinese food on, on, on Fridays, but this week, let's get grinies. <laughs> Thank you. Did you break it? No. Did you break it? No. Alex broke it, you guys. No. I didn't break it. <laughs> uh uh Alex, can you excuse me one moment? I'm just going to... Where are you going? Where are you going? Just gonna grab oh. one of these, uh... Oh, wow. You look like you're about to be refreshed. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. It's okay, guys. We got to die peach snapple. We're fine. All right. Yep. Perfect. Okay. Got him. Keep moving. Oh, to the right, there's a dude. Yeah, I see him. 
That's not a roof, dude. That's a normal bro. Oh, get down, get down, get down. He shot your hat, Alex. Don't let that man That live. was my hat! Get down, get down. Oh, Whoa, God. Dude. That guy's still alive. Oh, no, that's right. Dude, really. that dude up there. You gotta get down. You're gonna die. No, I'm not getting shot. There you go. Now there's a guy right to your left. Just right to your left. Probably looking at you in the face. There he is. Oh, he's so dark. All right, let's go. Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh shit! They're making a run for it after them. Who is making a run for it? Nice. Oh, still alive. Still alive. Oh Whoa. my god! Oh Up my top oh, and oh, right oh, there. Oh. Behind the car. Yep. Get somewhere. Duck. All right, fine. Okay. I'm not going to question it. Go. One more dude left. He's chilling right there. There you go. Got him. Look at you. <laughs> I love that shot. That's the best shot in the pan back. The one where it just him like quickly reloading. Oh shit. <laughs> Dang. A little flirty. Getting a little flirty on the dispatch. All right. Hold on. Yeah. Before we go to the interview, we have to go to this meeting place. Isn't that, isn't that where we just went? Oh, that was the meeting place. We got to go to Chaman's oh, Chinese. I thought you went to the Chinese theater. This is not the Chinese theater. We went to the meeting place. Yeah. Okay, my bad. We gotta I go thought, to we gotta we, go did to you go to this place on the way to Man's Chinese? No, we w we decided to go to the meeting place before okay. we went to. Okay, I'm dumb. I thought Shaman's Granny. Sorry, sorry, my bad, dude. The reason the reason that we didn't go to the theater in the beginning was because we thought that's where like the the, the shootout was going to be, and literally the other two places that we went so far have been literal huge shootouts. Oh man, okay, let's get over there, Shaman's. I hope this doesn't like knock out my opportunity to interview Courtney. I don't know why I would. Right, if he wants the interview, he'll wait. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Did you get five experience from that run-in? I was just checking. Oh, you found a landmark. That's what it was. I was just checking to see uh, how strong it was. Sure. No, no, you want to check the integrity of the electricity, right? Right. Um, before I was a YouTuber, I was a uh, electrician. Yeah, I worked for Edison. Dude, Hotel Roosevelt, tight. Dude, I played there one time. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, so my brother's getting married, you dudes. You getting married at the Hollywood at the Roosevelt Hotel? I think so, right, Jock? Dude, yeah. that's gonna be that's gonna be a great wedding. It's gonna be tight. It's gonna be a super Guys, tight wedding. I'm here. I just want everybody. Are to you just gonna roll into the Man Chinese? I don't know. You know, pretty much every other time that I've ever rolled up to a building, there's been some sort of cutscene. But I guess today, I'm taking the red carpet. What's this? A badge? Oh. Yeah. It's one of those badges. Remember I found one when I was climbing around oh, with yeah, Rusty? Oh, yeah, the secret shield. Remember this, Gerard. Yeah. For later. To, I have to do it. Maybe it bugged because we went here too late? I don't know. Like, where? I'm here. Oh my god. This is the worst. I'm I here. hate this. I'm here, dudes. Guys, I'm here. We can't go inside, probably. Can you open the doors? I'm here. I'm alright. I'm gonna I'm gonna go around the block. You know what I mean? Like maybe if I go far away enough, come back, it'll like reset the whatever. Alive. This is a nightmare. All right, so oh no, I looked it up, Alex. What? Here we go. Here's a great glitch. What's the glitch? In the PS3 version, when you leave the head po when you leave the post office, heading for Grauman's Chinese Theater, you have to drive it. If your partner drives, oh wait, never mind. That's not what I meant to read. Yeah, if you're traveling from the Hollywood Post Office to Chinese Theater, do not take the back streets. 
One of the alleyways on the route is the meeting place, and entering the alley will automatically trigger the cutscene for the alley shootout, skipping over the entire Grauman's car chase entirely. It's impossible to go back following the alley shootout and replay that section. You will have to repeat the mission. Mission. So, what are you doing? We we're we're screwed. We are screwed, boys. You serious? Yeah. We we have to move on. Wait, no. We can't. We can't. We have this to move on. Cost me a fortune, you moron. Oh Alex. yeah, this is your car, right, Roy? <laughs> Fuck you, Roy. It's um, a police car, though. It counts as damages. Well, we should start the mission over and play back to here, right? Either that, or we continue on. It's up to you. What do you want to do? No, like, look. Let me let me be let me be straight about this. Normally, I would be fine with that. Yeah. But it's the fucking Grumman Chinese Theater. So you want to to redo the whole mission to get to this point? Well, I mean, we're close to a point where we could c cut it off anyway. We could just like next time on Beard Bros. Next time on Beard Bros. Start it from the Grumman's Chinese Theater. Okay. Right. Sure. Cause like it sucks that we didn't get to see it because of some dumb glitch. That's true. Did I misremember? Did we actually? Did we actually do? Did we actually really drive to the Grauman's Chinese and then we actually went through the alley and went to the meeting place? Yeah. That's really what happened. Yeah. That's why I was confused. Wow. Well, here. How about this? Press start. Try quitting. That's not a bad idea, brother. Cause this game isn't very good about saves. Yeah, you're right. You're right. Let's try it. Last time it saved was. I don't know. Resume. Damn, dude. I mean, it did save afterwards, but... Maybe it'll be fine. Maybe a reload? I don't know. I don't know. Th th that sucks, man. How could there be that many glitches? Patch that shit. There's a lot of glitches in this game. It's only in the PS3 version, too? Patch no, that shit. No, this one is PS3, 360, and PC. That same glitch? Yeah. Yeah, it looks like we already... This is as if we did it already. So chances are... Oh. We're gonna have to redo this mission. All right. You know what? Oh man, that's gonna suck. It's gonna be the sword of justice because I'm feeling much more dangerous this time around, guys. It's been real, but next time we're gonna show you that goddamn Chinese theater. Oh my god, it sucks. I know. Thank you, Ellie Noir. <sighs> All right, guys. This is the second time we've had to like. Redo a, a whole mission? Yeah. Yeah. All right. See ya. Bye, guys. Bye.